you ever wanted to protect your home security camera or your NAS drive or home internet from power failures? Well, this is the review you've been waiting for. Cyber Power vs. ABC. Crazy mother... QA test and it seems it's passed. On the features side of things, the CyberPower has a front LED, but we'll get to that later. The APC has more plugs. No, I'm using the Australian version, which actually has a mains connector. Most versions out there have the kettle lead connector, which isn't as usable. Both devices have an Ethernet surge protection port. Both devices have a USB connection port to connect with a NAS drive or your PC. Although the CyberPower actually includes the USB connector cable, the CyberPower also includes a serial port, not too sure that's for. Alright, so in this test we're going to be seeing if the APC handles a Synology NAS drive unit and Wi-Fi router. So we turned it on and connected it via the USB cable to the Synology. And now over to disk station, control panel. In hardware and power, the UPS has been detected. And there's a couple of cool options. If you enable UPS support, you can specify that you can turn off the disk station early before the power runs out. You can specify seconds, minutes, and hours. I selected 10 seconds to ensure that the Wi-Fi router keeps on going for as long as possible. Unfortunately, after about two minutes, the UPS unit just completely turned off and failed, and power to the NAS drive and Wi-Fi router was completely cut off. This version of the APC, even though it has a USB connection and it's detected by Synology, it does not respect the 10 second rule or any rule you specify. Now it's time for the CyberPower. The coolest thing about the CyberPower is its front LED display, which lets you know the power consumption and how much battery life is left. The device can also be managed by this station, just as we did with the APC unit. All right, so we just tested the cyber power and unlike the APC, it actually did manage to shut down the Synology device after the 10 second time limit. And even though the Synology shut down, there was no hard turn off like the APC was doing and the Wi-Fi module was still working completely fine. So I'm, I mean, APC just don't do it, it's rubbish. This guy, it's got a LCD to tell you what's going on and it's actually reliable. So if you're thinking, like I was, what's better to get, cyber power or APC, and what UPS actually works with Synology, because Synology's um, compatibility list is very, very old, get yourself a cyber power. This guy's called Value 1500 ELCD, LCD. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you guys find it useful. Oh my God, cyber power. Rawr.